Hey Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs, welcome and welcome cross watchers. I hope that you are all having an amazing day so far. I am going to be taking a look at what's manifesting for you at this moment. What is going on right now in your current situation with you and the person that is on your mind, if any. So whenever you do come across this reading, it will be the right time for you to see it. And as always, only take what resonates and leave out the rest. Don't forget to like this video and click the notification bell if you would like to be updated for future videos. Okay. And don't forget to follow me on all social media, TikTok, Instagram. I am Spiritually Goldie on all platforms. All right, Cancer, let's get into this. I'm seeing that in the past here, um, we have a storm warning, which is basically showing me that you had some sort of doubts about a situation or a person, something brought you some sort of warning or red flag that you saw we have the moon reverse so you weren't sure if it was all just in your head if it was all just an illusion or what you saw was like something real i'm seeing imprisonment um so a situation that maybe you felt like you were kind of stuck in or restricted to trying to figure a way out yeah, literally, Eight of Swords, Imprisonment. You are in your head a lot, Cancer. And you have been, you've been, sorry about that. You've been feeling like you, you're stuck. I'm seeing a lot of reversals, which is showing me some sort of major blockage or stagnation there's some sort of stagnant energy surrounding this situation that makes you feel like wow like uh, you're trying to get out but you can't or you feel that way or that's what you're thinking um nine of nine of cups though so i do see that you've been taking action towards your happiness and ultimately your wish fulfillment and feeling like what you were hoping and wishing for was soon to come towards you. I'm seeing the nine of pentacles as somebody around you. This person is someone who's very independent, self-sufficient. Um, they don't really need anything from anyone. They do well on their own. This is the way that you see them. So I see that you're wanting changes to happen because it feels like you're stuck or something in some area in your life isn't changing. It isn't moving. We have changes. I'm seeing you want something to be over and done with. You're ready for this completion and it feels like it's a struggle right now, but things are changing. All right. We have date cards. So you may be dating someone. Okay. Okay. You may be dating someone, but it feels like things don't really go anywhere. There's some sort of movement or action that I see you trying to take, but you feel like you can't make this change or this movement here. So maybe you're trying to literally move homes or uh, change locations. There's someone around you wanting to, oh, okay. Wanting your forgiveness. This is an ex-lover of yours who is trying to um, trying to have your forgiveness over something that they have done. They may have lied to you, Seven of Swords Reverse, or they've done something behind your back or they were sneaky. And they're trying to reconcile things with you to have balance and have some sort of peace between you two. But I'm seeing right now, you've stopped investing into this. 
And um, you may be contemplating things though. You may be contemplating whether or not to forgive them. But it's showing me that you have taken a break or you've, ta you've paused, taking time to pause and reflect and see what's working and what's not working because you're seeing something like it wasn't working and if since it's not working and it needs to change right you're trying to build something for yourself you're trying to build a legacy for you your family your kids if you have kids um but you're still trying to figure out how to do that because you feel like you are trapped in some circumstance here okay maybe it has to it involves your ex which is holding you back an ex lover of yours judgment reversed okay this person feels like you've judged them or you were you're judging them right now yeah they look at the situation like it's went cold they they see you clearly like you've distanced yourself you have um released emotions from them like you are no longer showing them um the old version of yourself here yeah they see you like you've spoken up or you've spoken your truth they see that there's some sort of communication coming from you um about some sort of toxic situation speaking your truth or speaking clarity on a situation that you're trying to figure your way out of and they want to they want to make some sort of compromise for you they're willing to make a compromise in order to find a solution here but there is something that they are needing to put an end to they're ending something that's no longer working in order to compromise and have some balance with you I'm seeing unexpected income so this person may have lost some unexpected money okay let's look at the near future here somebody is doing a lot of thinking king of swords energy thoughts thinking about someone Trying to think more rationally about a situation. I see you finding the courage or confidence here to take some sort of action or speak your truth on a situation. Finding the confidence to work something out here or work something out um, together. Ace of Pentacles, you have a new opportunity for yourself. I'm seeing a new solid offer. This could be a work situation, a new job that you end up finding the the confidence to to make this movement towards a new job possibly for some of you, but I do see you trying to be more confident in yourself and in your decisions, your decision making process. Like you're really trying to change that there's someone around you who you see them as making some sort of changes like they're starting to prioritize you a little more with everything else that they have going on so let's look at the outcome we have the high priestess reverts secrets coming out there's secrets coming out here someone lied some sort of lie is coming out if you have lied about something it will come out and you will regret it but if they lied about something you will find out and they will end up regretting it okay it looks like ultimately um you walk away there's something missing or it's not all that you thought it would be here moving away leaving it behind because somebody is a liar and again this person has lied to you before they are going to lie to you again they will be heartbroken they will be really in their head about it and stuck mental something mental bad health mental health I'm seeing on this person's side um, but this chapter will come to a completion and it will end 
So the numbers I'm seeing here is 29, 27. We have 9, 16, and 31. So with that being said, this is what I'm seeing for you. If it resonated, let me know. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you want. It helps me out and it helps the channel. And I hope that you all have an amazing rest of your day. Bye.